In this short Figma tutorial, I will show you how to make the scroll animation work with a scroll bar or by dragging your content. Let's get right into it. To make the video as short as possible, I already created some components. I have the top of my model and the bottom of my model. And also I have the item that will be contained on my list, the list that I will be scrolling. So the first thing that I will need is a frame. And the width of this frame needs to be 375 because I'm working for a mobile bottom sheet. So this will be 375 and I want the color to be gray. The height of this one depends on what we want. So it can be something like that. And now I need to create the list that I will be scrolling. And so for that, I will import my component called list item. That is basically a comment. I will duplicate this, pressing option underneath, and then I'll put these two under an auto layout, select and press shift A. I did this to make it easier to duplicate. I will press command D. Now one around this number of items. And to make it more obvious that the scroll animation is working, I don't want all these items to be the same. So I will select the images real quick and change them using unsplash. Now I'll look for Unsplash and I need to find 15 images. So I'll look for docs. And something cool about Unsplash is that if you press option and select, then you can select as many images as you want and import all of them at the same time. And it will keep the order that you select. So I need 15 images and two more. Cool. And then press insert images and they will show up here after the loading ends. Now I can move these inside my frame. And now I have space for my scroll bar. So to create the scroll bar, I will use a rectangle item. So I'll press R, create a rectangle like this, and add some border radius for the line that goes underneath. I will duplicate this, move it underneath and extend. And I want this line to be a little darker, something like that. Also, I want this to be thinner and this should be on top. Now I can add the other elements of my modern sheet. So I will import top element, we'll go here. And I will also import my bottom element. I will go underneath, cool. And now I can select all the three elements and frame selection. And this will be my bottom sheet. That basically it's for the design. Now we can start with the prototyping. Now for the scrolling animation, I need to duplicate this. And then for this one, I need to scroll until I get to the last item and then select the thumb of my scroll bar and move it towards the bottom, something like that. Now to animate this, I go to prototype and select the thumb and connect this to using drag and smart animate. And the same for this one, select the thumb again, connect here, use drag and smart animate. And now I can see how it looks. Click on the thumb. I have this scroll animation. And now to finish this, the only thing missing is to make it also scrollable by clicking on the content. So for that, I go here, select my list, connect it with this bottom sheet and change this to drag. The same again here, select the list, connect to this bottom sheet, change it to drag, smart animate always, and come back here. And now I can scroll tapping on the list or I can scroll with the scroll bar. And that's all I have for this video. I hope you learned something helpful today. And if you want to learn more about Figma, Adobe XD, or anything related to product design, follow me and see you on my next tutorial. Bye-bye.